uh, get a close up on this if I can and try to keep it in frame at the same time. Okay, so I'm cleaning out the hole and basically I've got a little pair of tweezers I use for that, but I've got this down to where I can get the rest of the foil out. It's very important to clean out the hole. Whether you're doing a Tiffany style lamp out of copper foil or whatever, you always clean out the hole. And this is how you do this. You have to heat the solder so that the foil lets go without pulling, yanking on it and pulling the foil off the adjacent piece because especially with this being Chinese, God knows what they used after they soldered it together to clean the glass, wax the glass, you know, you get all that off and then, or you, you yank the, you yank the, the, uh, the old copper foil off you yank it off and then you have to foil the adjacent piece and no matter what you do to your copper foil it doesn't want to stick and that's frustrating to me you know why cause yourself all that grief and I, I can understand that you know doing Chinese repairs it doesn't live up to our expectations we expect it to act a certain way and it doesn't so a lot of us don't like to work on the Chinese shades. Pull mine. I'm still cleaning out the hole. I still have to where am I? I'm in there somewhere. Ah, here we go. I still have to clean out the hole. I still have to clean out that hole, which is melt off, melt off the old solder that's on there, which is not fun, but it's necessary. Okay, thank you.